Hi, I'm Raquel of the Yoga Slackers, and today we're going to learn how to daisy chain a slack line. To start, hold the loop side of the line and the end side of the line in one hand. So let's drop this to the ground so you can see. I have the loop and the end of the line on one side in one hand. Now I'm going to take my time to find the middle of the line. Okay, so I just keep the loop and the end of the slack line in one hand and find here the middle side. And you can see here that I took a pencil or a pen and marked the middle of my line because we do this often. Uh, so I don't mind having that small mark in the line. What I'm gonna do is take that middle part of the line, hold everything in one hand, so I have the middle of the line, my loop and the end of the line. And now what I am going to do is that I am going to start a daisy chain. We you start by flipping the line over, creating a loop on its own, and then from there, I'm gonna pass my hand through and grab the webbing in the other side. And with my thumb, I'm going to pull down. And that's how I start it. You can take and add a tiny little bit of tension on that side, but it's not necessary. Now from there, I'm going to continue passing my fingers through. I don't really need to pass my entire hand. Grabbing the webbing on the other side, feeding it through as I pull with my thumb to encourage the webbing to go by. And I keep doing that. If I don't have a lot of twists and turns on my webbing, it's really nice because both uh, or the four webbing pieces pass together and it creates a really nice and tight daisy chain. And you can even spend more time making smaller loops if you wanted to make it even prettier. Now, I'm going to make it to the end of the line and I'm gonna pass that loop through. And the advantage is that now I have a relatively short piece of webbing to deal with for storage. I will take my carabiners and I will pass them through all the loop sides of the line. Okay. And this is how I will travel with it. I have a carabiner, two carabiners, the line lock, everything is connected. So if I need to let go of one piece or put one piece together, uh, I know where my system is. And I will put my black anchors attached to here too. But that's for a different video, right? To undo this daisy chain, all I have to do is take this end out and pull on the line and the line is going to come, the knots are going to come undone on their own. And notice that I started my daisy chain on this side of the line, on the loop side, rather than in the middle of the line. And the reason to do this is that once I undo my, da once I undo my daisy chain, uh, I end up with this in my hand. So now all I have to do is separate this, go around my tree, and this loop is big enough that I can pass the, all the pieces of webbing through, and it's really easy to set up and take them. Um, so again, we can, hmm, we can take both all three pieces on one side, so the middle of the line, the loop side, and the tail end of the line, create a loop through and then pass it slowly and gently to the other side. Take your time, it's worth it. It's better to spend some time daisy chaining a line than spend four times that uh, taking knots out. Cool. So that is your daisy chain. And again, we are going to start taking out the daisy chain from the last part that we use. Now, every so often, someone will do the daisy chain for you and they might start in the wrong direction or you might have forgotten on which side you started and you take a loop out and it doesn't come out. Um, and you might be tempted to just have to do it one piece at a time. If that ever happens, go to the other side of the line and try there. More likely than not, you are starting to undo the daisy chain in the wrong side. But if this happens once, all you have to do is undo that other side again. Now, pass it through in the other direction and then pull. And that is going to undo your daisy chain 
from the funky side. All you have to do is undo that other side again. Now, pass it through in the other direction and then pull. And that is going to undo your daisy chain from the funky side. <laughs> 